Hello there everyone, welcome to another episode here on this um, High Elves Lord campaign. Let's go and betray these guys. Declare war. I know that is a slight uh, act of treachery, but I'm fine with most uh, factions, so that is okay. I know that the odds are going to be amazingly odd, but I have a lot of... Uh, Good units here. There's there's no chance for them. He has some Marauder horsemen. You know he's sending everyone in, but you know my my units are just amazing against this. And he has like seriously very bad guys. You know, some of these guys are very tired. So I'm pretty it much expecting that the first the first army gets destroyed without doing the anything. Asua the second need. army does some damage, and the third armies are just going to do something. A strong leader is needed. Uh, let me check the terrain. I think it will be great. Because this is the opportunity for me to catch a lot of these units. The deaths so. are necessary. Let's fight up the battle. So yeah, look at the amount of units that he's sending. 1,141, 554, 440. Uh, I'll have to check for the reinforcements where they are coming in from. But I have plenty of cavalry to deal with those guys. And I can just engage head-on strong against these guys. Because my archer units are also spearmen. So there's nothing that these guys have that can threaten me. You know, most of my units are actually just good, generally good against them. So yeah, that's going to be cool. So in an overall sense, I believe I have much better armies than scalings. Or let's say that my armies are just well made to deal with scaling armies. You know, lots of archers, spearmen, against what he has, it's like poor guy. His infantry units are very weak, they will get lost before they reach my lines, and then I have an eagle to deal with the generals, you know, just give him some damage and stuff, and then everything else that he has, it's very easily destroyed with my flanking cavalry, or if they try to attack me, it's they're gonna go against my spearmen, so I mean, it's, it's fairly easy still. So yeah. I'm going actually to use my spearmen, kind of like Macedonian tactics. I'm going to have ma my spearmen covering my uh, uh, horsemen. So even if he tries to attack them, it's, it's just silly. There we go. So I can see that the reinforcements are mostly going to come in from that side and that side, which is great for me. I can just straight up move over there and cause some damage. Yeah, there we go. So these guys just take away the skirmish and put them on guard mode. That way they can defend themselves. Spearman. Spearman, you're gonna go here. I'm gonna have the cavalry with you. Spearman, that is group four. You're gonna have the cavalry, group five, with you. There we go. White lions. White lions are gonna go here along with the other white lion and you, general or uh, eagle. You're gonna go over there. Let's start up the battle. So yep, yeah, he's probably gonna send out his forces against mine. We will obey. So group two, yeah, all of his forces are coming in. It's not like I had a better place to put my units into. So he's still gonna get the best uh, position there. Let me just make sure that these guys, uh, they'll have that flanking. We go. This guy is just gonna go here. Okay, group five. There we go, like here. There we go. 
See, there's nothing that these guys can do. It's alright, guys. Yeah, he's gonna hit these Chaos Trolls. And they're just gonna die before they even reach us. Yeah, there we go. That's cool. Over here, there's nothing he can do. They're all attacking those Marauder Horsemen, so yeah, that unit is already getting lost. It shall be done. These guys... Let's go over there. You can see the map to see if there's any threats over here. Yeah, it seems like he's sending some Chaos Warhounds. There we go. There we go. Let's check that out. Yeah, look at that. That unit fell over there. These guys are just doing nicely. Just move in. There we go. This eagle... Where is the general unit? I don't see it. Oh, there we go. Over here, he's losing there. That's nice. You know, let's keep charging there. There we go, let's move over there. We go! Moving out, as you say. For a Surion! Can I be praised? There we go. Oh hi over there. White Lions! Loyal! Black Oil! It's fine, that doesn't cause too much damage there. Let me check my lady. Let's get the Chaos Sorcerer there. There we go, let's hit this. Hit this. Let's hit this. Thank you. Over here, how is everything? Oh, really? He's sending those guys? That's cool. What is this? Chaos Marauders? Let's just attack them. That is nice. Understood. Yeah, these guys are going to go over here. Yeah, is, is there anyone hitting here that is doing any headlock? Nope. He's sending some Chaos Marauders there. Let's attack them. Let's slay these Chaos Trolls. There we go. Send the Illyrian Archers here. To the fray! Yeah, those guys are gonna get hit, so here's the what I have to do. These guys are just keeping these guys busy, honestly. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna charge over there. These guys are gonna move in here. Eagle, just get away there. Okay, over there they're attacking just nicely. Let's attack these Chaos Marauders. Let's move in over there. Take this skirmish away. There we go. Keep attacking them. Seems like the units are attacking here. Silver Helms, let's attack there. Or actually here. This lady. Hi there, dude. Actually gonna attack here. My lord is on attack is doing just nicely. These guys, let's just move here. Hang on. Here we go. Cavalry, let's get a, get lost there. We go. Let's just strike here, honestly. You can see that my units here are just gonna die. So I'm honestly just gonna charge them then. There we go, they're a leading reverse. These guys should do the trick. The eagle over there is doing just some nice damage. Yes. Asa, withdraw. Asa, advance. Illyrian There we go. Let's attack over there. Let me just see Orders these received. guys. You can just hold on here. There we go. For I know that he can do some damage here, so it will be done. There we go. Yeah, over here I'm losing severe uh, units, Move but it, it's fine. I'll have the effect that I want. These guys are just destroyed or getting destroyed. Can I be praised? There we go. These guys just Onward. retreat there. 
We got this. There we go. The other unit, let's just attack there. Actually, no, let's attack this Chaos Sorcerer. Thank you. As you say. Just attacking some spearmen As there. You say. It's fine. As you say, we will obey. Northern Sea Guard. Acknowledge. There we go. You're hitting that Chaos Sorcerer. That is excellent. Serve the king. As you say. Yeah, I'm going for the mass route situation because, of course, my cavalry just charged Silver here helps. on the back. You know, it's not the best ideal situation, but maybe I can actually just cause several units getting destroyed. There we go, let's hit that guy. Let's get away with it, with this. As soon as I hit that guy... Yeah, this is the trick. This Chaos Sorcerer of Metal. Over here everyone is just routing away, that is excellent. So I can just concentrate Put these you know. units and attack that Chaos Sorcerer. There we go. Over here, how is everything? They're surviving, they're gonna be able to. For the king. There we go, oh, let's attack. Not the best place to defend against them, so Broder. I guess for now Ancestors. it's doing great. It's amazing how these guys survived. Without fail. For the Ever Queen. There we go. Love and sea God. Okay, Black you away. gotta attack these guys. Okay, get away with the, the eagle. Did I? Did she lost? Okay, she ready. did. But this guy is nearly hitting the Chaos Sorcerer, so. Moving out. Love and sea God. There we go. Seal. Orders to see. Kill them. Death to there we go. Where's the Reavers, this guy? Yeah, these guys are just gonna charge Put here, battle. I guess. Need to kill that. Because over here, I'm managing to withstand the charge, but that'll be difficult there. We go. Okay, this guy needs to charge Attack. there so that they will rout. Yeah, as soon as the general is dead, then they all rout, of course. Noble Prince. That I knew, you know, as soon as that wizard goes down. For order. Yeah, everyone starts routing. So of course I lose some units, but it's excellent Battle that we got. Now I just need to capture lots of these units. Ready. You know, some of them are not going to flee, so... For duty. There we go. There yeah, we go. Cool. Cool. You see, even without being the best place to defend myself, they did just a wonderful job, so... That's why I said I have the best units to deal with this. Where are these guys? Let me just pursue some other units there. You guys, is there anyone not pursuing? Thank you guys, let's just pursue. Got it. So yeah, I guess I'm doing just fine. Or I did just fine. This guy caught the enemy lord, so lots of enemy lords here that are gonna get destroyed, especially this Chaos Lord. They were doing their effectiveness there, but I, I'll still survive with enough units to fight, and I can recruit better units as well. I mean, it's okay. I think I should honestly just re uh, regroup some of these units and recruit a better set of units, you know? Like this one I can disband, honestly I don't see any other influence for these Lothan Sea Guards. And there, are, there are two uh, on, on experience, right now I can recruit them with that starting experience, so I don't lose that either. I just want to make sure that this guy gets killed. There we go. It's a Chaos Sorcerer, but like I told you, even with having the best, uh, you know, the numbers uh, on their side, the terrain on their side, they actually controlled really well on this flank because of the reinforcements. I was expecting the initial army to get routed much faster. That caused this this deal, of course. 
Now I gotta remember that reinforcements here arrive much sooner than medieval two. There is also a good a good example of a you know a a fight so that I recall some of these of these situations. Yeah, the fact that these lords survive so long when completely retreating just makes me sad a little bit. You know, he, they shouldn't survive that long with this. There we go. Let's end up the battle then. They considered it a Fyrick victory. I do not. I can get a lot of units back. Like, as long as my eagle didn't die, I think I lost only one unit. A spearman, maybe? And he loses. Look at his losses. Like, I lost half my army. He loses everything there. I can conquer this city right away. Like, he loses three of his uh, generals there. Not only can I conquer this city, I mean, look at the kills on each Illyrian unit. On each unit! By itself, you know, the least one has 49. Yeah, look at that. No, the least one actually is the Eagle with 25, but of course the Eagle was fighting their generals, keeping them busy and causing some havoc there. So, yeah. His Marauders actually caused some damage, which is interesting to see, you know, that my Lothan Sea God can't or couldn't deal with that. The trolls were just there to, uh, you know, soak the arrow damage, so I guess that worked for him. He was also on the high ground. If I was on the high ground, this would be totally different as well, so, you know. A completely different outcome in that case, I would say. Come on. Let me see what happens. If the eagle gets destroyed, I'll just uh, hire a dragon for this guy. Right now I have the, the armies for that. And I think he should just have a couple more white lions. I mean four or something. I could hire maybe a ballista for him and some white lions as well. Come on, I hate these loading times. Sorry about that, guys. It's not the, the best. But at least I hope you enjoyed the battle. Even though I was in the worst terrain possible against a lot of numbers. Look at how many uh, casualties I managed there. The Illyrian Reviews, I mean, they couldn't soak too much. But it was nice seeing two units of spearmen withholding a long force. Like, those were like five to six units victory. there. So I get a lot of money from that battle, of course, of course I do. Even gain some armor, we'll see about that. Of course the rank, he gains a lot of experience. Right, so right now, yeah, he doesn't take, he doesn't get too much. This is the settlement garrison, so I'll have to fight that up. Subjugate them. Yeah, if I get this, I lost only one single, one single Spearman unit. Remove their bombs. I, treasury doesn't matter. Look at that. It's not enough. This is not enough as well. It must be done. Like I didn't capture that much, so I'm gonna replenish my units. Of course. Is its own so he's gonna get away. I'm going to attack this. Got that. The gods stand with me. Enemy killed, enemy killed. That is nice. Buildings constructed, I gotta check that out. Deaths in battle, that is cool. Lord of the Phoenix Court. So I'm gonna check his uh, to a skills. 
Leadership aura size, missile resistance. Wow, your section. Yeah, that, that is cool. But I would love to give him just this for more for my white lions. Bonded service. So recruitment cost. I usually would go for that a lot, you know. But there's nothing really, really interesting there. Sometimes they have like. Um, no, this is great, of course. The keep for all units and quartermaster. With quartermaster, you can get just amazing armies. But uh, so far, I prefer them to have a little bit better stuff. Uh, I'm actually gonna get this. Yeah, I'm actually gonna get that rural guard there. And now you're going the to attack Asur here. Have conquered. I'm not gonna auto resolve because I may lose the eagle there. Oh, and he's also sending out the other units. So I am going to have to fight this. I guess I'm going to fight it as well on this turn, uh, this episode. You know, so that you'll you'll get to see the complete annihilation of these guys. Because I don't want to have to send my eagle. I just want to send my uh, archer forces. You know, in front, even with the reavers, and that should do the trick against all of these units. I mean, there's nothing you can do about that. And I'll keep my uh, units... I may even replenish more units because of this, so that's cool. So, the Battle of Trelinia, it's actually an excellent battle name. For, to remember, because Alastar just wrecked the scaling. That means they're going to be focusing, of course, on me, but uh, I'm doing just fine, I guess. So right now I'm controlling the flanks, which is uh, of the map, and I should be wary of controlling the middle. I actually need to control the whole island before anything. Because if I control the whole vortex, I'm doing just amazing. And then all these places will just have uh, a lot of good uh, production buildings. You know, that'll be excellent. Come on, let's go. Cool. So right now, this is the idea. You just deploy there. These guys deploy here. I don't know where the reinforcements are coming in. Oh, he has them over there. That's cool. And the rest of the units, I'm just going to join him all. Behind, there we go. The eagle really far away. These guys, I can just move them here, that's okay. So start up the battle. Yeah, he's gonna send everyone in, and of course, as soon as these guys are in range, my archers are just gonna do, gonna wreck them. And group 2, they will have the skirmish mode, but of course, they're gonna rip them before that even happens. So yeah, look at that. Let me just see this. I'll keep an eye over there. In the Marauder Horseman and the Poison units, of course. Yeah, they're using some shields, but they're taking fire. They're gonna take way too much fire to be able to withstand that. Can I be praised? Yeah, there we go. Already the Hounds are fleeing. And now I can tell these guys to attack. There we go, let's move them in. Yeah, look at this. Those units are broken. These units are now gonna get smashed. This was not meant to be. That was not meant Our to be at all. That's the X infantry as well. Like, look at that, he's already retreating and getting killed. These guys, poor boys. Marauder horsemen. 
We're just getting slain. There we go. Safely end up the battle. Everyone dies. That's cool. Easy there, guys. Very easy there. So I lost two units. That was cool. But you never shoot all the resolve on these battles. Sometimes he'll just send the eagle and get killed, or send one unit that is low, and it will get killed. So you know, I'm gonna join after this battle some of these spearmen and even the cavalry units, so that I can recruit more units. Uh, I'll hire a new general to recruit some of these units uh, and distribute along both armies, I guess. So I have to see what are the best units to provide, you know. Probably just having some ballistas in some places. Uh, we'll see about that. Like, because for instance, for this army, I'm not going to give him many archers. He already has the the units that I want there for archery. But I'll give him a ballista and maybe a sun dragon or or a dark dragon, um, another kind of dragon or something like that. We'll see. We'll see. That's why sometimes you want to merge the units so that you don't have to, to worry too much about the kind of units that you have. Of course, you can always replenish them. They'll, they'll be replenishing all the time. But I don't I don't feel like it's a necessity here. Come on. So on the other side, I just want to fight that uh, that battle on the fortress. Uh, I'm certainly not going to siege it because it's just going to take way too long. I have to fight it, and for that reason, I need to see what units they have and maybe give my Tyrian guy some excellent units to fight that. Another ballista, for instance, would be interesting, and then a sun dragon or something like that would also be very important. I have the money, the resources for that. I mean, I'm. I'm already. I have almost spent the money that I needed for most of my provinces. My my best province is almost my capital province is almost fully completed. Two of the settlements are already fully completed, which is nice. They have garrisons. As soon as I can stop having garrisons there, I can even develop these better. I can just keep an eye, you know, on those. And yeah, that, that's cool. I mean, I actually built garrisons, just predicting that I might get uh, some some attacks. Especially, well, if I consider that, I kind of need the garrisons on the capital building, on the capital province, because of the um, the attacks that will come in from chaos forces as soon as we start a new ritual. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Now that I think of it, yeah, I gotta I gotta be careful with that. But on the other places, I can soften it up, especially. Places who are in the middle that I can defend with just an army. Or two. Glory to the king! So yeah, still get some loot gain from that. I have a lot of money for that. I got a dragon horn. That is nice. More missile damage or more weapon damage. That's cool. So he's a good dude. I'll have to check that out after. We are the conquerors. Let me occupy, of course. Leadership against Norse I am a Syrian reborn! Okay, so he cannot fight this that guy. Will incur my wrath. But he'll do so very soon. Uh, Trelinia, yeah, for sure I need to build this up. This is a port, so that is excellent. He'll give me some good growth, then. He's giving me growth here, which is excellent, actually. Let me just check the building browser. See if there's anything uh, really important there. Not really, everything is pretty normal there. The other place also has the gold, so that's I exactly where I want to go. I guess I could assault the units. The enemy yeah, let me must see. Be punished. Success, so he also gained that. I gained a follower of public order. A worthy ally. Okay, so this guy, I could get that. Now let's just increase the trade, why not? And did he gain the follower? He gained that. Public order, local province. Uh, I'm gonna give him none, by the way, and I'll just give that that follower to this girl. Oh, uh, she cannot have that. 
how about Tyrion? Can Tyrion have him? Yeah. I think it's much better. Yeah. This guy has... This is a noble that can do that. Okay, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Everything, everyone Our has traditions that. traditions give me strength. So Loyal this guy should give him a skill. I don't like the speed; it doesn't give him too much. But I'll get the battle master strategies there. And now I'm actually ready to do this. So let's merge those units. That's cool. So I have 18 out of 20. Here's the deal: I want to merge these guys. Maybe even delete that. I'll see. How can I assist? Okay, that's two silver helms. Let me see the upkeep. That's 223. I like these guys. But I would delete this. I'm gonna disband this unit. Lethal grace given for. I like these two spearmen to accompany these guys. I can delete this, disband this unit. There we go. So I need five units. Should I do that already or should I just... Right, I'm gonna go this. Let me see over here. Do I have anything else? I have this. Okay, so I'm gonna do that because uh, you know it's it's not something that I can upgrade. I don't have anything else that I can upgrade for now, so that is excellent. This this uh, is already producing everything that can be produced. And after a couple of turns, yeah, like on the next turn, I will be able to move in over here to the Griffin Gate. That is cool. Diplomacy. Let me see you if Tyrannoc would. This treaty. Speak. Impossible. Chat that, okay? I don't. Defender of the. I can speak. I would love that confederacy. I'm listening, fellow Asser. I bid you welcome. Absurd. Okay, no trade agreement with those guys. It's kind of fine, I guess. Black heart. My time and temper are short. Yeah, I don't like this. Let's cancel. I would need to conquer most of their places, but it's okay. Here or not move? That would be this guy. This girl, I'm sorry. It's alright. And there we go. And this is for the public order for all provinces, two turns. Okay, the predicted income is nice. I'm not sending any stuff we for now for the rituals advice. because, you know, that is kind of okay ish on my side. Like, I'm just gonna, gonna attack this place and have everything done so that I can get that gold. I'll also move in over here. There we go. Also we need... Yeah, yeah, so the next lord is actually just when I'm going to move here. Spot all of these places. A recent battle site. I don't know if he's going to need anything there, but I'll, I'll have to spot that. That'll be on the next episode, though. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Bye-bye.